there's so many differences about what makes us Northerners that people in Southern Ontario just don't understand us really in a lot of ways it seems like. It's hard to put your finger on it exactly. I think that there's something that affects you when from pretty much anywhere you can look out your window somewhere in your house and just see bush. Sudbury in the north is a great jumping off point to touring and being able to live properly and being able to afford to live properly and make records and do this kind of stuff in the north. Uh, my name is Mark Browning and I'm um, the main person in Ox. I guess I'm the founding member and sometimes the only member of the band. I play guitar and sing and write uh, most of the songs. I'm Brian Dunn. I'm from Sudbury, Ontario and I'm the co-owner of Cosmic Day. so different. And we were friends. We were introduced while I was recording uh, in a studio here uh, in my early 20s. And we connected and we knew that we had the same goals and the same kind of drive and that we wanted to spend as much time together as we could kind of developing a sound with Ox and then and then later this place and, and you know we we float on very similar waves of and ideas of, of you know how we want to end up what we want to accomplish so we were connected right right from the start two or three years of touring we came home we were both living he was living on the west coast and i was living in toronto and we came back to sudbury at the same time and decided that instead of making records in other cities where it wasn't comfortable or feasible that we were going to open this place as a studio and make records out of here and then after that we decided that we should sell guitars. When we came back here and built this studio, like this is our studio, so that's the other reason why, um, why we returned to Sudbury because it was like if we keep spending $10,000 a record on someone else's studio it's just, it's just not going to be sustainable right so and the idea of having your own studio is, is something that I mean all bands would like you know to be able to have the freedom to do what you like in your own place build it the way you want it and uh, so I mean for me that's kind of the key thing about recording up here the fact that we were able to create our own studio and, and work in this place and sort of create it to be the kind of studio that we feel comfortable with and uh, it, it's it's been really cool for that reason yes. There's certainly something going on here. I mean, I think that a lot of uh, musicians up here have figured it out. And, I mean, there's a great scene in Sudbury and North Bay and the Sioux. There's a lot of stuff coming out of here. The Sudbury music scene's got a lot of variety to it. There's a lot of people doing a lot of different things. And I think a lot of it's because there's just so much that comes through here. All the great bands come through Sudbury. We get lots of stuff, you know, on tour heading to Ottawa and to Montreal and then out to Vancouver. This is the hub. And I think the other thing that's really good about Sudbury specifically is that how well all of the different participants in the music community here work together. It's, there's, there's no competition at all. It's like we're all helping each other. Everything you do is going to be better than the last thing you do. And as long as you just, you know, keep working at it, and keep trying and keep playing live and keep traveling and keep recording and keep writing. It's only going to get better. A lot of people, I think when they're teenagers, they, they grow up in places and say, I got to get out of this, you know, hole. And um, this is not a hole. And I used to say that, but this is not a hole. This is a cool place to live. It's a really good place to make music. So. Um, you can go and do what you like to do, um, but eventually you might want to consider coming back here because it's a good spot to be.